for the following sequence of numbers, 1 half, 1 twelfth, and 1 thirtieth, and so on, what would be the next number? So when I see problems like this, looking to find a pattern in a sequence of numbers, I try a couple simple things first. The first thing I look at is whether or not we're adding or subtracting the same thing between terms. With a little arithmetic, it becomes clear that we're not adding or subtracting the same number from term to term. So we can eliminate that option. And the second thing I'll try is whether or not we're multiplying or dividing the same thing from term to term. So notice that going from term 1 to term 2, we're dividing by 6. But if we divide by 6 again, going from term 2 to term 3, we would get 1 72nd instead of 1 30th. So we can eliminate that option as well. And from here, the problem's a little bit trickier, but what we can do is take a deeper look at these denominators. So notice that 2 is just 2 times 1, 12 is just 4 times 3, and 30 is just 6 times 5. And once you write it like this, you can see a pattern. The first term has the first two integers, the next term has the next two integers after that, 3 and 4, and then the third term has 5 and 6, the next two integers after that. So following the same pattern, we can deduce that the next term would have 8 times 7, which is 56 as its denominator. So the final answer for this question is that the next number in the sequence would just be 1 56th.